Okay, today I'm going to show you how to use the auto summary feature in Word. It's a very useful feature if you need to summarize something or something's really long, you don't really understand it, or you just want to shorten it up and not read the whole thing. So, I'll open Chrome for or my browser first so we can research a topic. Let's say you want the quantum theory. Okay? Quantum mechanics. No, well, let's do quantum theory. Okay, on Wikipedia, I know some people not may not like it. Uh, you know what? I'll just do quantum mechanics. Okay, this is really long and confusing. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to copy it. Control C. Go to Word. Paste it. Now this is all here, and it could be like very confusing. You don't want to read it. So what you're going to do, you're going to use the auto summarize tool. It's up here. I, I added it up here, but you if normally if you have added it up there, you can add it. You click right here, customize access toolbar. You would go to more commands. Okay, in here you would look for auto summary tools, but since I already have it, it's over here. You would just click add. Then you click OK. I'm not going to, I already have it. So you just click OK and it would be up there. So then click it up here. Click Auto Summarize. Okay, there's four different options you can do. Um, I like Insert and Executive Summary at the top. So it still has both options there, or both things there the summary and the original text. You can change how much you want. I'm just going to keep it at the default and press OK. Okay, and there's a summary up there. Uh, so, there you go. It's very useful. See, it totally shortened it. It's much easier to read. Okay, that's it.